Hello everyone, welcome to Geeker Mag. So Microsoft started updating compatible PCs to Windows 11 2 for H2 automatically. I have covered everything about this news in my earlier video. If you want, you can check it. The link is in the description. On the other hand, if you don't want to upgrade to Windows 11 2 for H2 and prefer to stay on Windows 11 2 3 H2 or 2 2 H2, then you can pause the update for maximum time by going to Settings, Windows Update, use the drop down next to it and select the maximum time. Let's say 5 week and you are done. If you want to stay on the current version that is 2.3.S2 until it reaches end of service, then here is what you can do. Before we start following the process, if 2.4.S2 is downloaded already, then open File Explorer, go to C Drive, Windows, Software Distribution, Download. Here delete all the content inside this folder. Then follow the next step. If you are running Windows 11 Pro Edition, then click on the search icon and type gpedit.msc. When edit group policy appear in the search results, click to open it. Now navigate to computer configuration, administrative templates, windows components, windows update, manage updates offered from windows update. Double click on select the target feature update version. In this window select enabled. In which windows version box type windows 11. Next in the target version for feature update type version. If you want to stay on Windows 11 2.3 H2, then type 2.3 H2 or 2.2 H2. Click OK and apply. Close the group policy editor and you are done. For home edition users, click on search icon and type reg edit. When registry editor appear in the search results, click to open it. When USC dialog box appear, click yes to continue. In the registry editor, navigate to computer, HKEY local machine, software, policies, Microsoft, Windows and Windows update. If the windows update key is missing, then you need to create it manually. For that, right click on windows update, select new key and name it windows update. Now select windows update key on the left side and then on the right side, right click and select new dir 32 bit value and name it target release version. Double click on it and set its value data to 1. Click OK. Following the same procedure, right click select new string value and name it product version. Double click on it and set its value data to windows 11. Now create another string value and name it target release version info and set its value data to 23 h 2 or 22 h 2 depending on your preference. Now close registry editor and restart your computer to apply the changes. And this will keep you on the version you have selected. At any point you want to unblock this, simply undo the step. And that's all for this video. If you find this video useful, don't forget to like this video and subscribe the channel for get notifications about more similar videos. Thanks for watching.